هاي اند ويلكم تو اور تي في شو اي ام سيور سلامه اند اي ام عثمان الرياض اند وي هير ان ذا ميدل اوف ذا ديزرت يو ويل اسك واي بيكوز وي ار غونا دو ا دوكيومنتري اباوت كاملز سو ستي وذ اس Now we are here in the tent. Oh, are you? Hi, mister. We are here to do a documentary film about camels. What did you say? Huh? What? Come on. Come and talk to them. Welcome. What do you need? We need to do a documentary film about camels. Oh, I hear it, Bandar. They are here because of the camels. What? I hear Bandar. They are here because of the camel. We don't have camels for sale. No, mister. I meant a documentary film about camels. Let's go to the camel. Okay, okay. No robots. I am old now. Go away. Okay, okay. No problem. Man's relationship with camels in the Arabian desert and his connection to them culturally, socially, and economically, and the extent of the distance of this relationship throughout past and the present ages. The son of the Arabian desert relied more on the data of nature, as camels were present in all their details in his daily life, and he did not dispense with camels in the past and in the present, as they became an icon of his heritage. as they were the source of his food and economy through their many products. Historical stone inscriptions have proven the depth of this relationship between camels and humans as they formed a basis for ancient commercial caravans in transporting goods and fetching water. In addition, the multiple uses of their skins and fur, including making robes and nearing water. Among the most types of camels are the Majiham and are called Najdi camels and are characterized by their black color and large size, its size and abundance of milk production. Here are the camels. Are you the shepherd? Yes, I am. Since when have you been a shepherd? Taking care of camels is my career since childhood and there is a relationship between the shepherd and his flock. My relationship with my camels is like my relationship with my family. Every time I was away from them, I missed them and they missed me as well. What are the things make camel different from other animals? The camels are called the ship of the desert and they have abilities can withstand thirst and the heat of the desert. Okay, but does Allah say something in the Holy Quran about the camels? God Almighty said, do they not contemplate on the camels how they are created? What do we get from the camels? We get milk and meat and the Prophet, peace be upon him, urged us to eat camel meat. Look, it is so beautiful. Hussein, pour them camels milk. Okay, sure. Take it. Thank you. It's tasty. Thank. Sweet. For sure it. What is the characteristic of the camels? The camels are called the ship of the desert, and they have abilities can withstand thirst, and also they fast. It's time for lunch. Oh, thank you very much, but no, we are late. This is not your realm. 